we are in the studio, Natalie Murray. Ten years ago, it was Natalie LaRue, and I was playing with her and her brother, and uh, they became family to me. And uh, here we are again, recording and uh, having a blast, and, and uh, it's great to be back with them. Why did I decide that this was going to be the year that I was going to, you know, make a record again? I don't really know, to be honest. Um, a little bit of, of it was, um, although I haven't been in music as a musician and an artist, um, you know, I've still been writing songs. to be honest um, he's always believed in me we met when we were doing music um, and he's always wanted me to start again he's always wanted me to um, I don't know just has been a big believer that uh, what I have to say is significant and um, so he kind of pushed me in a good way in a in a I love you and I know what's better for you than you do kind of way. He kind of pushed me. You know, I'm really, uh, really, really proud of Natalie. It has been too long since her voice and uh, music has been available for others to hear. I mean, I've heard these songs through the years, you know, um, when she used to live in California, I lived in Florida, and I, we would travel out and see him, and she'd kind of play me ideas, and I was always like, you need to make this record, you need to make it happen. idea that we could really take something small that came from an upstairs attic and turn it into an actual record, um, it really got me excited. And then another big component, to be honest, was Don Schaefer. We met with him in the beginning of the year. He was kind of this missing component for me of um, how to take something that I've been sitting with and wrestling with for so long and expanding the ideas of those songs. And I really knew that I needed that kind of partner and um, I just didn't really know how to look for it or where to find it. And so I really feel like it was the Lord that brought him in at just the right moment in time. And and because had I not met him before we decided to do Kickstarter and all that, then I wouldn't have been as excited.
Natalie's been a pleasure to work with because she's um, both knows what she wants and is not afraid to say so, but she's also really open to ideas, which I don't know how, how many, what people think artists are like, but that combination is a real one. When I got asked to sing on this album with this song with Natalie, I was thrilled because I think of Natalie as a great talent. Vocally, she has a voice that um, rises above many other female singers out there. It's crisp, it's clear, and it also says exactly what she's saying lyrically, and I think that's really important. You can understand that she believes and is delivering honest lyric because her voice portrays that. I'm thrilled that I got to be a part of this album, and I can't wait till other people can also hear it. that know what they want and don't want to hear ideas, or people that want to hear ideas and don't know what they want. But she's, she's the perfect combination for collaboration. Like, it's really a pleasure to make music with her. And, um, and I feel like the result is not only good, but <clears throat> it's like what she wants. obstacles to overcome in my life right now. You know, I have a nine-month-old. I have two kids in school. Um, you know, I have a whole life outside of this and let alone, you know, my husband Rob and his jobs and all of that and balancing all that, taking time to and setting it aside to make music a priority again. It was a big sacrifice, but um, it was definitely coming to the end of that, working through this EP and finishing it up, it, it, it feels more than worth it. And I, I, I don't really have words to describe it. Hold him by 